The general movie-going public demanded the nationwide release of Paranormal Activity in October of 2009. The movie has had a frightening effect on audiences across the country, including the Woodward Cousins. My name is Michael Woodward. Okay. My name is Kenyon Woodward. Okay. Cousins. Cousins. Like whatever, but I don't know, man. Just it seemed too real, man. It was just it was done really good. Yeah. Very well made movie. Done you think... really good for bringing up people's experiences they've had. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Making that fear come to life. People's fears have come to life because the movie touches on the major themes of demonic possession and the devil's hour, 3 a.m. More and more horror films are focusing on the time of 3 and 3.15 in the morning. I'm going to explore the 3 o'clock hour in detail in just a minute, but let's go inside the darkened theater for the live reaction of how the film impacted the Woodward Cousins. How did you how did you find out about it? Uh, he told me about it and I regret coming to see it. <laughs> Do you really? Yeah. Why is that? He sleeps uh, alone. Yeah. He sleeps alone and it's, it's one of the I'm gonna be sleeping movies. alone tonight, so it pretty much sucks. And you're probably gonna wake up at three o'clock in the morning. Yeah. Do you know the significance of three fifteen is? No, I don't know. The 3 o'clock hour is, in general, considered part of the witching hour, but it's more specifically known as the devil's hour. The reason this becomes the devil's hour is something called the opposite method. Used by satanic practices and beliefs, the opposite method is used as a mocking of the Holy Trinity, God the Father, the Son Jesus Christ, and the Holy Ghost. Now, the devil is the opposite of God. Good is the opposite of evil. Pentagrams are often upside down as the opposite of the Star of David, etc. Christ's death is believed to have happened at about 3 in the afternoon. Now, there are several scientific analyses that have been done from Sir Isaac Newton in the 1700s to astronomers and their computer programs in the early 2000s that more or less agree with religious teachings that 3 p.m. is the time of Christ's death. So, the opposite of that, obviously and mockingly, becomes three in the morning. So with Christ gone from the earth, there is nothing to protect us from the evil that inhabited the earth at that time. Also, it is accepted by many in religious circles as the time the veil is the thinnest between this world and the other world, in which we are most susceptible to suggestion, influence, or interaction from any evil spirits that may want to do us harm. That's why 3 a.m. becomes an important theme in these types of movies. 
So let's go back and ask the Woodward Cousins again the importance of 3 a.m. And you're probably going to wake up at 3 o'clock in the morning. Here we go. Do you know the significance of 3.15 is? No, no. That's, that's the witching hour. Really? Or the devil's hour. There's no good to fight evil in Christ's spirit. It's taken from the earth so that, so that the evil can... You know, so, so Christ was not on the earth at that time. Ah, that was ridiculous. Oh. No. So, so what scared you the most? Her body moving off the that, and being drugged down the hall. That to me was just, that was messed up. I don't know it how looked, that could it be It looked like, way too real, dude. I don't even, the subtle things, like not the body, not the theatrical stuff like that, but the more the... The demonic growl and the bang on the wall. Mm -hmm. just, like just standing there staring. Or just at the him footsteps. Man. You hear that kind of shit at your house. You hear that <laughs> stuff at your house. You know. At least I do anyway. Just stuff that you kind of messes with your head. And mm -hmm. that sucks because I heard shit like that. You I hear just, that. Uh, and it. Your 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 uh, leg shaking here too. Yeah, I've been doing that the whole movie. <laughs> Dude, I like, I instantly got chills like all over my body right at the end right there. I couldn't even breathe. I was like, what is going on? What about you? Is there anything yeah. in your past that might be contributing I, to how, how you feel right now? There was a time I worked overnights and mm -hmm. I came home in the morning and I was going to go to sleep and I was like laying on the couch and I was like slowly falling asleep and then I heard like footsteps like approach like the front room where I was in mm -hmm. and then go into the kitchen and then come back slow and then it's just everything like stopped and like I couldn't move like I was like too scared and then like the footsteps just like took off like quick like towards the back of the trailer and then like nothing else happened after that but I didn't sleep that day I like caught up and went to my friend's house. I can see your eyes are kind of moist not <laughs> not that you're crying no, I'm just no. saying and just saying, yeah. you, you, you can see that there's some emotional reaction that you've had to this. Yeah, that movie is like intense. Like, I've just had like a lot of like bad encounters with like weird feelings and stuff. Mm -hmm. What will your encounter be with paranormal activity? I hope this helps you understand the role of 3 a.m. in horror films. And please let me know any experiences you've had at 3 o'clock and watch my other paranormal activity videos.